Joe Lightsaber back again with another video and you may be wondering why you've not seen as much videos from me in the past couple of days that's because I've been working on my new cryptocurrency which some of you in the group may know about I'm just showing you some of the code here you can see it's all coming together you will have a github and you guys will be able to review the code for those of you that know how to read code I certainly don't but my developer does all right guys and that's all I need <laughs> so yeah, I mean, it's definitely something that I've been working hard on. Definitely something that I think the community will appreciate, or at least I hope that you do. All right, guys, and if you want more details about that, I hope to launch that potentially for pre-sale this week. All right, guys, so you guys can support the channel. My main intention is to give something back to the community, um, as well as, um, you know, be part of something innovative. And, you know, it's, it's definitely a dream of mine to create my own cryptocurrency. And um, I just thank the Lord that, you know, it's, it's been made possible for me to do that. All right, guys, and hopefully you guys can all be a part of the journey. Um, you know me, not personally, but you know me at least. Uh, you know I'm a real person. You know I'm an honest person, or at least I hope that you know that. And there's going to be no rug pull. Um, there's going to be lots of details for you guys to look over. But if you're not subscribed to the channel, maybe you should subscribe and you'll be able to catch what's going on over the next uh, couple of days. All right, guys, because I do intend to launch that pretty soon. All right, we've got a very good team um, that's pushing for this. And, um, you know, I'm just glad to be a part of it, to be honest. Okay, I am the founder, yes. Um, but, yeah, I mean, um, this is something that, uh, you know, you might say, is, you know, it's, um, it's a bias. Um, I'm talking about my own project, but I do think that it's going to be a great project. All right, guys, if you get behind that, um, in my opinion, you won't regret it. All right, guys, but you have to come here. All right, you have to come here if you want to know about it first. If you want any of the DLs. This is the best place to come for it. All right, guys. And I'll be doing stuff like AMAs, all that sort of stuff. You know, like I said, there's a GitHub. We're going to open a Telegram group, uh, Twitter, uh, all of that juicy stuff. All right, guys. So stay tuned for that. Definitely exciting. But let's get on with the video. All right, we're going to talk about DM script. I'm going to talk about a little bit of Bidal and maybe a little bit of FWT freeway token. So starting with DM script, we saw a massive rise from DM script. Some people are asking me, should I, um, you know, am I still holding DM script? No, I'm not. I'm not holding DM script at the moment. In fact, I've had hardly any time to do any trading over the last couple of days. Like I said, I've been working hard on this project. Okay, but um, yeah, time to take a look at these charts and see what's going on. Okay, so if we start with DM script, like I said, we've got this kind of bouncing W pattern over here. Okay, so we saw this spike up over here. I did put a note out in the uh, in in, my, in the group, the Telegram group earlier. Someone asked me about DM script, and I said, hey, look, it's bounced up and it's touched resistance. Okay, so it may pull back. All right, guys, we need to see it get above this level to remain bullish on it for the short term. In the long term, yes, I do believe it's a bullish project. So if you are holding, you know, I don't blame you for that either. All right. But um, yeah, talking about the market cap as well, it is very still, still very low. Um, Two million dollars. OK, it was up from that. Don't can't remember how much, but it was up from that. You can obviously see that over here. But right now we're seeing a pullback of approximately from the peak to the bottom ultimately the pullback was about 61 percent okay now it is trying to make some way back to the upside now whether this comes back up to test this resistance or whether it stops here and then rolls back to the downside only the next couple of hours can tell us what is going to happen all right but dm script is definitely one that's low cap and definitely one that has potential considering the partnerships that they've got um some people were a little bit weary about this one from the beginning or from way back here way back here okay but over the last 30 days you see this has gone up over a thousand percent you know and uh yeah if you did take a position down here when we we're first talking about dm script let's just see what how much you would have made at the top okay so i was talking about this potential cup and handle way down here in fact we were talking about it over here and we expected a breakout we we're talking about it over here when we saw this handle forming okay uh and that's on the lower time frame okay then we also had the higher time frame we had this big old cup and we had this massive handle over here um it started to dwindle off a little bit i expected it to just go straight to the upside it did dwindle off and go sideways a little bit and then we got the massive boom and that was pushed by a little bit of news and a good chart setup all right 
but if you did get in from roughly around here when we first started talking about DM script when we're looking at it breaking this um, line of resistance over here we're looking at ultimate 520 percent approximately that's what you could have made on dm script if you would have hold, held that now me personally there's not a lot of projects that i do hold dm script is one that i would say is a potential long-term hold all right guys especially after a pullback like this it's a better time to get in all right it's good to take profits when you see a parabolic move like this okay take profits that's just my opinion all right guys and then you can always get back in when it comes back down or if it comes back down all right but if it doesn't come back down at the end of the day you took profit you can't beat yourself up over something like that okay so dm script uh yeah looking bullish at the moment but um you know it's early it is early i won't make a move on it despite that okay if it does come up and gets resist uh, uh um, get uh, reaches this resistance and gets rejected again there's potentially more downside for it but who knows you know they could put out some news and it could just take off again they put this out earlier this is the only news that we see from dm script today i personally don't know what it's all about it's gone blank okay don't know whether okay it's not good enough with anything we're not putting it so it's dm studios okay um so real but it's unreal okay don't know what that means um don't know where they're going with this dm studios maybe they're talking about you know filming stuff uh you know games you know gaming or or, or movies maybe who knows we'll have to wait and see exactly what they're talking about when they bring some clarity on that all right but yeah that's my review on dm script for the moment okay let's quickly move on to fwt okay we were bullish on this before the weekend ended since then we've seen it come down just a little bit okay or should i say quite a lot all right let's do a measured move on that okay roughly about 60 percent approximately okay and could have some more downside now it's starting to see a little bit of green um whether it comes up and tests resistance anywhere over here you know and it gets rejected it continues to the downside that is yet to be seen if it does take out this level down here let's move that if it goes below that level i would say there's more downside all right so this is the level that it needs to hold at least and we know that for sure okay because it's a long way down okay and there's no support under there all right but it doesn't look like it at least okay you could say this little thin area of support is support but you know yeah it's, it's not looking good if it does break below there but i am bullish on fwt long term uh, that doesn't mean i would say take a position now you know this could do a full retrace and come all the way back down in my opinion and if it did i would definitely be looking to buy down here you know i don't think it's likely to come all the way down back to the beginning because i think you know a project like this that has so much bullish potential i believe that you know the pullback is something that's going to get bought up by you know um, people that know real value when they see it but yeah that's all i can say about fwt for the moment all right now bydow is you know what can i say about bydow is still uh, downtrending okay we talked about this before until we see it make a new high and new and um, higher highs and higher lows yeah we can only assume that this is going to continue downwards all right and therefore i won't make a move on it am i bullish on buy down no i'm not not at the moment okay long term do i think it has potential yes i do okay but having potential and realizing that potential are two different things all right in school they used to tell me i had potential all right uh, unfortunately in school i didn't realize that potential right i was getting in trouble all the time you know i didn't realize that potential okay now i'm getting older i'm a little bit mature all right um i think i'm starting to kind of you know re understand why i should have listened to the teachers back then all right but um you know going back to the to the to the main point of what i'm saying is you know we can all have potential but whether we realize that potential is two different things that's why it's called potential because you may not get there okay so that is by dow one more thing i will say about by dow is they put an announcement out okay if we can find it they are oh what's this so that wasn't here before so we'll take a look at that in a minute but they put this out earlier warriors uh, we are doing a buy down socks giveaway now what are you, who wants these socks do you want do you want these socks let me know in the comments you know um 
my socks are just fine. You know, I don't. I'm not that much of a geek. Right? I'm not going to be going around with bite out socks on. But hey, if that's your thing, you know, I'm not knocking you for that. But can we get like a token burn or something? Can we get something like a little bit more exciting than that? Just my opinion. All right, guys. Um, okay. So I haven't seen this announcement. Looks like it just came literally two minutes ago. You can see 6:25 here, and it's 6:23 here. So two minutes ago, let's just have a look at what it says here. So the team is busy working on the token bridge and CDP system. The token bridge is already nearly finished, and we are making huge progress with the CDP system. In the current development stage, we already support different crypto assets as collateral assets like Link and many more. You can read more about the current developments here and there's a medium article for that so you got erc20 to bid i don't know what that is about you know um you know what now that i'm working with a developer on my own cryptocurrency i actually realize how much i don't know <laughs> and, you know these guys are smart right these developers here are smart people believe you me right there's a lot that i don't know all right and um yeah i mean let's just leave it at that okay so yeah that's about it for now if you're not subscribed to the channel please subscribe like and comment also you can follow me on twitter at crypto lightsaber you can also become a patreon link is in the description for that you can also join me on instagram oh and by the way becoming a patreon means you get access to the telegram group okay crypto lightsaber all right that is my announcements all right and over here we have the chat group always something going on in here guys are chatting away even while i'm doing this all right guys so yeah that's about it for now and i'll see you guys in the next video